Hello faux fam and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be very different from my other videos. So as you can tell by the title, today I am going to be doing a body transformation video. This is my 35 day workout. I'm gonna be doing Chloe Ting's Summer Shred Challenge. I've started Chloe Ting workouts so many times or just working out and eating healthy in general and it never pans out. I always give up or I take a week break and then I lose all the muscle and all the results and then I eat whatever I want and then nothing happens. So I figured the best way to stay consistent is actually making a video about it and this video is gonna be focused just on overall fitness I want to change my body because although I have come to terms and love my body the way it is I know what I really want is abs and let's be honest like we've all always wanted abs so why why am I wasting my time not getting abs I can very well get it okay so we're gonna do it we're gonna do it we're just gonna do it this video is just gonna be about 35 days but I'm hoping that I will stick with this much longer and it'll be a complete lifestyle change. And just so you know, you should never compare your weight to someone else because everybody is beautiful. We are all made differently. So enough rambling, let's start the first workout. I decided to do the Summer Shred program because it looks like it optimizes fat loss but also has some toning in there, which is exactly what I want. I would like to try the Hourglass program as well, but one program at a time here. So the first workout we have is full body fat burn and it is the longest workout on the workout. It is about 25 minutes long. And that is also paired with an ab workout. So let's get started. Of course, it's not working when I'm actually feeling motivated. Okay, here we go. That should not be legal. <sighs> I don't know if you guys can see like how sweaty I am. My Apple Watch was dead, but I probably burned so many calories. Oh my gosh, the 25 minute like fat burning one. It gets ya, it's good. Here we go, workout number two. <sighs> I don't wanna do it. Day one, <sighs> complete. I am extremely sore from yesterday. That's not stopping me from doing today's workout. Day three complete, just did abs. I literally um, hate everyone, everything, and I feel disgusting, I'm sweaty. I hate being sticky and I'm so sticky, but tomorrow is a active rest day, and then I'll be back ready to go on Friday, so <laughs> bye. <laughs> I really like I'm not feeling motivated at all to work out I will do it anyway even though I don't want to the first week before I even worked out I ate so good this week has been there's lots of birthdays and stuff so it's been questionable next week maybe I can show you guys more of my diet when I actually am eating more healthy I'm just trying to change the lifestyle and not just be on a diet I don't like being restricting with myself but I do need to like set boundaries so Yesterday was actually rest day and I forgot to talk to the camera because it was Easter. I just took progress pictures. I don't know if I'll show them. I'll decide at the end of this video, but I can already see a difference. Like I can see more tonage, more fat going away. Like I'm so excited to see the end result and to keep pushing. But also something else that I feel like has helped a lot is we've been playing tennis every night and like I burned an extra like two, three, maybe even 400 calories just like running, playing tennis. Here is week two of working out. We're in the dark basement. I just got out of the shower. 
Today is Monday and we are going to be on week three of my Chloe Ting 35 day challenge. So I just took my two week progress pictures and oh my gosh, like I have to put them in, I have to. There is such a big difference. You can actually start to see like definition and like fat is just completely shredding off of me. I didn't think I could see this big of a difference in just two weeks. So some updates is I definitely feel stronger. I obviously look better. I feel better and my form I feel like is getting better and my stamina, like I can actually get through the whole workout without just dying. And I know I said last week I would talk about what I've been eating, but I ate so bad. It was, there were so many birthdays. It was my husband's birthday, my niece's birthday. So this week, once again, I'm gonna say it, hopefully I actually do it. I'm gonna try to eat a little better. We're almost halfway through this challenge. We are gonna start week three, day 15, here we go. So because I was recording everything on my phone for the workouts, I kind of lost a lot of the footage or maybe I didn't record. I don't know what it was, but I went all the way to day 25. So here's me talking at the end. Guys, we finished the challenge. I am so impressed with myself, honestly. Here's a little body update. I'm in a bikini. This is what my body looks like right now. And I'm really, really proud of it. Not where I want to be, but definitely bounds ahead of where I was before. Real quick, because I don't have an actual like before and after picture or anything, I'm gonna show you guys a video side by side from like me in a bikini of last summer and then what I look like right now. And in both of these shots, I'm like stretched out so you can like fully see like the difference and I'm way more toned now and I'm super excited to just keep pushing myself. This challenge has made such a difference in my life because I feel like I'm so much more confident in my body whether it's the fact that it looks better or just the fact that I'm like putting effort into it I don't know but I just feel so much more confident I can wear my bikini and not even care if people are looking at me and I just feel so much better about myself I worked out for five weeks straight at the end I did miss I think two days but I mean that's two out of 35 days that I missed so. and seriously working out every day has made me so much happier throughout the day and just like more energy and like something to look forward to doing every day it's definitely starting to become a habit and I don't really ever want to stop working out I continue to work out five days a week just like in these challenges and I actually have started the next challenge which is the hourglass challenge I'm on my first week of that and it's amazing as well yes it was very hard it was challenging because you know it's a challenge but it definitely paid off and I'm really happy that I did it everyone always asks like do you actually see results with the Chloe team workouts and the thing is like no matter what workouts you're doing you are going to see results because you are putting in the effort and I'm not telling you that you have to work out and you definitely don't have to look like a certain way. We're all beautiful in our own way and every single person's body is different. But I promise that if you do want to work out, you will feel so much better. And that's just one more step that you can take to be more confident. And also, I know I'm going to get a bunch of questions. My diet was not great throughout this, honestly. But I did stop like snacking a lot. But I would still eat like fast food. I'd get donuts and stuff. Just not like all the time every day for me i know a diet would never work because i will be so strict on myself and then i'll just like break it and eat like so 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 bad so it's just better for me to live a balanced lifestyle so i try to live by like the 80 20 rule 80 percent good stuff 20 percent bad stuff so yeah i'm still struggling a little bit with my eating habits but i'm trying to change them over time and not just have a dramatic like 
super strict diet. I'm not gonna be too strict on myself. So anyway, that's the end of the video. Just, you know, some basic stuff. I worked out and I saw results and it was great. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you wanna see more like where I do a challenge or like a 30 day thing or a two week thing, whatever it is, then let me know. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.